Hello everyone. In this video, I will explain this pointer in C++ programming. So this is actually a special pointer which is store address of current object. When we call a method uh, using object, so in that method, this pointer will be passed implicitly. So here uh, in this program, we will see usage of this pointer. So first we will include have a file, then we will specify namespace. So uh, let's create a simple class class one. In this class we will take one variable a and then we will write one constructor with one argument. And here we are writing a equal to x and let's create object of a class one and uh, let's define one more uh, function to print value of data member of class one okay so here uh, so if you can see here when we are passing we are calling a method how this method would know on which object I have to operate? So while calling this uh, method or function show, one pointer will be passed implicitly. So for programmer, programmer no need to pass any special pointer. It will be passed implicitly, and that pointer will be having address of this object. So inside this function, when we write data member name like a, so this function will access a data member of object ob so how this pointer will be passed there is a special type of pointer name this and whenever uh, we call any function inside that function this pointer will be having a, a address of this object so this is statement what we have written here that we are assigning x value to a we can write this one as well like we are assigning a value x to a data member a which we are accessing using a pointer so, and this pointer is having address of object ob so this pointer is actually available in every function in the member function of class whenever you call a function this pointer will be having address of object which we are currently operating on so uh, first we will see uh, what are the usage of this one so let's assume we don't know so, uh, is there any this point or not we are simply writing this constructor and let's assume someone change this uh, formal argument name by x to a so here we have written a statement a equal to a so when we will compile our program uh, when uh, this is statement we are assigning value of a to a now we are having two options one a belongs to this class one and one a is a formal argument but this statement in this statement both a actually will refer this formal argument so this constructor won't be assigning any value to data member of class one so in order to resolve this confusion we have to uh, specify explicitly that this a actually belongs to class 1 this is a data member of class 1 a and this a is a formal argument so here what we will write we will write here this a equal to a so this is the use of this pointer okay so this pointer actually it is store address of object on which currently we are operating on okay and uh, if you want to create a simple function which return current object so in those function at the end we can return star this so it will return object which is pointed by this pointer so these are the usage of this point thank you very much for watching